YouTubers, it's Mr. Lee Nice here. I hope you're doing good. And uh, this is a video by request uh, from my friend Shinobi Hogg. And uh, he was just asking me how uh, the uh, tech lock system, uh, how you can efficiently use that on uh, your Molly uh, uh, gear with your pal's webbing. And uh, <clears throat> for those of you not familiar with the tech lock system, uh, here it is. This is on the back of the GG&G Battlehawk Tomahawk. This is the just the sheath that comes with actually a pretty good sheath, I think. Um, now the tech lock has been out for a few years now. I'm not exactly sure how long. Like I said, a lot of you out there are probably familiar. For those of you who aren't, it uh, is just simply a uh, it's a belt loop, and it's also good for attaching uh, gear into your pal's webbing, which I'm going to show here in just a moment. And uh, now there are some other similar. Um, attachments to this out right now. There's also like um, uh, there's Molly locks. Uh, I know Blade Tech makes some similar um, style ones. Uh, the Tactical Tailor uh, Malice clips are also very uh, similar uh, in, in what they do. You cannot you know you can use them as uh, belt uh, belt loop belt clips and also they attach to your pal's webbing. But uh, that's just uh, yeah that's just what it looks like. And this is sort of a boxy little thing. I'm not going to take it off. And you snap it shut, and there is a a lock on there that you can uh, set on over there. But I'm just going to show you real quickly um, what it looks like on your belt, and then I'm going to attach it to my tactical tailor uh, Mav. Uh, taking a look at uh, belt usage for a tech lock, and I have here uh, this is just a Cobra style uh, tactical belt. It's made by Gearsmith and the Cryptech Mandrake. It's two inches wide. Now, uh, this uh, tech lock is definitely wide enough for that. There's a little adjustment uh, bar that you can put in there. I don't have mine in there right now. And so what you want to do when you uh, want to unlock it is you slide this little bar release back. Then you give it pressure on either side. There's actually a little bit of jimping on either side. Give that the pressure to pop it open. There's your open platform. Now, it works best if you take whatever... You know, it is that you're, you're using, you know, it might be a knife or something. It's easier if you take it out, but just for, to show you, I'm just going to slide it in directly up, okay, in one click, two clicks, all right, it's set, and then drop the lock in there, and I'm good, I'm solid to go on that for belt carry. And uh, that's a, uh, a pretty effective way to carry uh, something, you know, a tool, a knife, um, on your belt by using one of these tech locks. Next up, I'm going to show how to weave this into Molly Web. I'm going to provide a top-down view of how to attach your uh, tech lock system, uh, how to integrate it into your PAL's uh, webbing system. So uh, first up, yep, just uh, open it up. And uh, I find it works best if you use all three of these prongs. You slide them into separate loops, and I'll show you how to do that. Is I just grab the first loop, um, just with my fingers. There goes the first one, then I'm going to grab the second loop for the middle section, and then lastly, the third, and I'm going to get them all, and uh, take the tech lock, push it on through, and that is what you're looking at. That's going to give you a really tight uh, weave so that your, you know, your gear's not going to be bounced around too, uh, too awfully much, and then lock it up, and then put the final lock and closure over, and that is rock solid. And that's what it's going to look like. There's uh, the bottom underneath the tech lock. And then back the top view. And then the cool thing about these is you can rotate them on your gear however you need for different angles. Thank you so much for joining me on, on an overview of how to integrate and use the tech lock system on uh, your belt. And also how to uh, use it and integrate it on your Molly and Pals webbing. So it's Michelin and I signing out. And as always, have a good one. Take it easy.